And among all the parts of the body, the tongue is a flame of fire. It is a whole world of wickedness corrupting your entire body. It can set your whole life on fire. For it is set on fire by hell itself. James 3, 6. When people speak death into your life or come to crush your spirit with their wicked words, don't fight fire with fire, okay? Stop and think for a minute, okay? Be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to get angry. Remember now that you were smart, okay? <laughs> ah, refreshing, okay? You drank your smart water, okay? Not just any water, but living water, And then Jesus met you at the well and said, anyone who drinks this water will soon become thirsty again. But those who drink the water I give will never be thirsty again. It becomes a fresh bubbling spring within them, giving them eternal life. John 4, 13 through 14. Okay, you have a bubbling spring within you. For the scriptures declare rivers of living water will flow from his heart. John 7, 38. And what comes out of the mouth flows from the heart. So remember, it doesn't say don't speak. It says be slow to speak and spew out of your mouth that living water that comes out of your heart okay the word of god and put out that fire that is coming out of their mouth proverbs 18 4 wise words are like deep waters wisdom flows from the wise like a bubbling brook okay when you speak your lips are dripping with wisdom so you shut all that down everything that they're saying you shut it all down and you reveal how ignorant they sound the lips of the wise give good advice the heart of a fool has none to give proverbs 15 7 so don't try to put out the fire with fire put it out with the water a hot tempered person starts fights a cool tempered person stops them proverbs 15 18 and the word says to not just read the word but to do what it says do not repay evil with evil with the words that you speak don't try to insult them back okay and this is not an easy thing to do all the time okay this requires self Control and the spirit helps you with this. So die to the flesh and let the spirit lead. Okay. And the more you practice self-control, the better you get at it. A fool is quick tempered, but a wise person stays calm when insulted. Proverbs 12, 16. And sometimes it's just best to respond with silence and they will still have to pay for any foul word. That they have spoken to you, okay? Any any curse they've spoken over your life. The mouths of fools are their ruin. They trap themselves with their lips. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Proverbs 18, 7. They fall into their own pit. Okay, so walk around that pit, okay? And move on to the other thirsty people and sing. Come and drink, okay? Come and drink the living water that comes down from heaven, okay? My love, okay? My love, do you ever dream of candy-coated raindrops? You're the same, my candy rain. (laughs) I cannot sing, (laughs) y'all. His word is sweet like honey to the soul, okay? Give him that candy rain, okay? (laughs) Y'all, I want to do some praise dance, okay? Because I cannot sing. (laughs) But, yeah, put, put out the fire with the water, okay? You can't put out the fire 
with fire. So practice self-control and y'all have a blessed day. (laughs) 